All right, yes, you're welcome back to the Balanced Diet of Teletainment this morning. Happy New Month to everybody where they watch us on top. The Good Morning Ninja Show this morning. As long as you're alive, you need to appreciate the fact that you even there alive to even uh, to even complain or grumble. Say food, no day for you to chop. Because some people, as they talk now, so then they're six feet under. Some people, they, they rush there and go hospital. Some people don't slum. Some people have to try bomb picking, so it um, be like, say, them, don't walk go. Why are they picking? They are alive. So many challenges there is life, where as long as you not even carry yourself, go hospital, they complain about siki siki on top of your body, you need to just do it. Just they walk out, they go. Just they shock me. Yeah, they thank your own Papa Gode and Yachi. Talking about well body this morning, uh, that one now, uh, the primary focus we get because a lot of our stories, if they bother around this healthcare and our system and preventive measures on top of how well we want to manage, contain this coronavirus, we don't finally enter inside the country. Now, some people don't come outside, talk, say, surprise, they not be on top of them as they enter Nigeria because other countries were supposedly they fortified, quote unquote, is still enter their country. And uh, so, say, enter Nigeria now is not a big problem but the coconut and say how we go fit to contain them how we go fit to make sure say it not spread as fast as it's supposed to spread because what the organization don't forget just a few weeks back then we come outside they talk their fears on if coronavirus enter certain countries for africa um based on the healthcare the weak healthcare system say that they fear whether we go fit or some con african countries go actually fit to manage them and one of those countries they mentioned na nigeria and as they talk now so the coronavirus it don't enter inside our country yes we know say uh, we need to call on our spiritual leaders and every other person we get powers that be to actually took mat on top of this one but some people say they come outside they ask question in terms of sensitization of the people and that's not the primary focus on top of our top story this morning because now we don't hear say so state government uh, state governors they don't mobilize against um, coronavirus and the ginger victims will get symptoms so maybe they isolate themselves and they come on themselves and they just day by themselves for one place and um, to monitor how their body be for 20 days or even more now so they come outside they talk and people they ask questions and that's one i wait on one focus on this morning as our top story say so you feel Say the government don't do better sensitization of the people to educate the people on top of this coronavirus, plus including Lassa fever. Because as we handle coronavirus for one corner, don't forget, say Lassa fever, we don't decide to do collab with us for a long time coming. Yearly basis, they still there with a lot of states to the tackle. Now, people, they come outside, they ask questions. Say how well the government, they sensitize or don't sensitize the citizens in terms of preventive measures to take. So that they go, we go fit to protect ourselves from this COVID-19 we don't enter inside Nigeria. If you say the government, they try. Or if you say the government have to speak so, uh, say right here, they never even do enough to make sure say Nigerians, they are aware of this disease and how to tackle them. That's not the question we'll they throw, throw on top of your domo this morning. Say you feel say the government don't try their best. And how or which other measure you feel say we fit to do to improve the healthcare system for inside Nigeria. Not forget to say now at the time where we need a lot of doctors. Now at the time where we need a lot of nurses, now at the time where we need a lot of healthcare professionals for inside that field to come out and help and put hands together. So that this coronavirus, anybody will catch them, they go fit isolate and do the needful. But you feel say sensitization, is there enough on top of this coronavirus, plus including Lassa fever, we don't they hear up for all these weeks? Tell us what you think on top of WhatsApp machine, we'll be 809 Five, two. Tell us your name and your location and how you feel, say, uh, we fit to arrange ourselves to come together, collectively, come coronavirus and even Lassa fever from our country. All the way for your messages, uh, we could talk this one with the Chiamu on top of the Nigerian Governors Forum, as well as the AKT State Governor, maybe Dr. Kayode Fire, and come as I talk. For inside statement on Saturday for Abuja. In the appeal to Nigerians and foreigners, we get the symptoms of coronavirus. They may they isolate themselves for a period, make them leave room for confirmation of the status. Now, fire me, they come outside, they talk, say, every state right now, they don't they prepare it on how to tame the virus and say that they deploy all resources with their disposal to respond and contain the spread of this virus. This one, they share as federal government said, they took mouth on top of the report of the Uber driver where we carried the Italian man from Lagos to Abelkota. And according to the church of church, where they be they talk that time, they say allegedly say we test positive to coronavirus and if we don't refuse, say we then quarantine them. And um, but right now, as they get informed, they say Lagos state government don't actually come outside, explain 
how the Italian man will actually enter inside Nigeria so that a lot of people who go carry informate will know the truth. And now, according to them, according to the Nigerian Governor's Forum, Chiamu, the statement will come outside make. Instead, they don't um, deploy all resources where they are available to contain the further spread of the virus. Now, according to Ram, they say as a form of proactive step, the governors did not initiate monitoring infrastructure in all the states to ensure quick response and attention. Uh -huh. So they don't they try to make sure say facilities there on ground to cater to people within inside this category. From there, still on top coronavirus, make we enter Plateau State because the Plateau State governor the, or the government don't come outside talks, they don't quarantine about 43 suspected cases of this dreaded coronavirus for inside the state. Now, when they, they address the press conference for inside just on Sunday, the Commissioner for Health will be Dr. Landam. Don't come outside talk, say, 43 people low, nine they don't isolate for inside the Wasser Local Government Area Council of the state. And in come outside talk, say, out of that 43, if you want shift, shift around, he said now about 25 of them, nine be native, will be indigent, while 18 are non-indigents. In commerce, I talk, say, uh, in talk about the four uh, Chinese nationals, where they involved inside this uh, coronavirus matter, he said now four Chinese, so not be three Chinese or, um, nationals, as media, they come outside the career. In commerce, I talk, say, these Chinese people, then be they travel all the way from Ethiopia to Abuja, and finally to Wase in Plato State, where they actually they involved for inside mining. Instead, they don't screen them for coronavirus when they be there at Addis Ababa, and they will also screen them for inside Abuja for this same virus. Now, according to Ramin, they come outside, they tell the security agent to where they don't brief for them. So, maybe they don't allow them to mix with other people because, according to Ram, he say at the moment, coronavirus no day, but not only suspicion, not only fear, not only anxiety. Now they make a lot of people they panic that now why they, they do isolation on top of any case where they don't get now upon isolation time we don't expire that now that time they will come know who actually get coronavirus or who no get them now so you come as i talk um still on top of the coronavirus matter we don't they hear right now uh, say the Ogun state government plus lafarge africa they don't confirm say contact uh, don't confirm the contact in respect to the single recorded case of coronavirus, they say right now it don't hit 39 from the initial report of 28. Now this one includes the driver. We actually picked the infected Italian man from the hotel for inside the Keja where they miss our food and drinks. Now according to the report, they say contrary to the report they go around on top media, say the production line of this Lafash um, Africa, uh, Africa PLC uh, based on say be like say some kind of don't enter inside them. Well, uh, away Korobi, they come outside, they disclose them. Following the visit of the coronavirus infected Italian to the company's guest house, the management of Lafarge and even Ogun State government don't come outside. They debunk, they, they debunk any church or church based on, say, the one close the cement production line because church or church, say, be like, say, the production line they infected. They say, no, that one, I lie, yo. Anybody with the carry that carry rumor, they say, me the person stop them. Because according to them, they don't confirm, say, development, they, they don't confirm certain development at the Lafarge facility during the on-the-spot assessment by the host state government, uh, including Nigerian Center for Disease Control, will be NCDC, and even World Health Organization team, and the industrial director of Lafarge. They saw of them go assess, go check the whole place to see, to confirm, say, nothing, nothing, uh, don't buy for inside there. She still come outside, according to the commissioner of them, the Ogun Commissioner for Health, Dr. Tommy Koka. She come outside, they commend Lafarge Africa for the quick and proactive measures where they don't take so far, so good. Now, according to the commissioner, the commissioner don't come outside, talk, say, the state government, they don't activate an emergency operation committee where go manage any development from any reported case of corona. Virus. So right now, everybody, every state government, every big, big organization, small, small organization, medium organization, that they try their best to put in proactive measures to prevent the spread of coronavirus. Now, while some other states, they come outside, they complain, or they, they try to do the best that they feel to make sure say coronavirus, you know, they gallant for inside their state. We don't they hear say, some doctors now, it'd be like, say, they won't go on strike. Hmm. The Enugu State Ministry of Health don't come outside. They talk, say, the strike where they're supposed to embark on by the Association of Resident Doctors for inside the Enugu State Teaching, um, University Teaching Hospital. They say, be like, say, the timing, what did they do? Um, it no good at all, at all, because this timing is very, very critical. 
And the permanent secretary of the ministry will be Dr. Ifai. Uh, don't come outside, talk this one for inside statement. Will be they signed on behalf of the state commissioner for health for inside the state on Sunday for inside Enugu. Now, according to Dr. Ifai, in comments, I say, hey, hey, people, the anxiety and worry don't they start to because this strike where they come at this kind of time where federal government, plus including other state governments, them, they, they try to manage this challenge of this new COVID 19 with the coronavirus. He said, this timing. It no make sense at all at all. Oh. Now the Enugu state government, they receive with dismay, that one means with sadness for their body, the news. Say the SUT are doctors, they don't start, they do five days warning strike. He said, is this one, oh, it completely contradicts the creed of the oaths, which they actually swear to uphold. According to the doctor, Dr. Ifai, in common side, in don't note, say, they expected 24 hours of notice before strike, before they actually go on strike. They don't even give the state government. And they say this one, it is against the labor law when it comes to striking. He said, for now, according to all, according to the information they talk, he said, all the key officials of um, the Rad Ed Suits uh, Park Lane community, they don't remain in communicado, in communicado, as their phones, they switched off. Now, oh, me say, they don't mean them. They mean them. They say this one is strike, we go do them, and they don't actually start to do them. He say, I beg. Uh, make them actually come together, make them sit down, talk, on the same table, make them find a way to move forward. Because going on strike at this critical time, where coronavirus, people like say they fly like mosquito uh, for night and for daytime, they say they don't need this kind of striking at all at all for inside a Nugo state. We could see what they happen, but we could see as this one go actually go well with the doctors and the medical personnel for inside a Nugu. Because for them to actually sit down and say they won't go on strike, it means that they don't they complain. They don't they complain for a while now on top of certain things where they need to be in place for inside their state. So that's all we see on top of the things we share this morning, but still don't forget our top story, what they talk about. I'm waiting for this one where they ask you a question on top how well you feel, say, the government, they do it, they sensitize the people of Nigeria all over the 36 states on how they go fit to do what they need to do to take pre pro pro proactive and preventive measures to stop the spread of coronavirus for inside the state. If you say the government is sensitized in us all well, or if you say sensitization to reach certain places and certain people don't get certain information where they need to know on how to prevent the spread of coronavirus. Feel free to send us your message on top of WhatsApp machine, maybe 0809-032-1452. To enjoy more of this, our will get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.